for those of you that don't know, my name is Katie Wayne and I work with Animalist News. Some of my boss people came up to me and they were all like, we love that you love animals. And I was like, yeah, dude, cool. And they were like, you wanna do like a vloggy show about animals? And I was like, yeah, that sounds awesome. And they were like, okay, but we need like a catch. So it's gonna be about the weird and gross things about animals. And I was like, but I don't really think animals are weird or gross. And they were like, hey, also beautiful. We're talking about maggots. Okay, so maggots are like gross, but you know what? I find very few animals to actually be gross. And I think that maggots would kind of be a little bit cute because they're all like meh, meh, meh. Maggots, what are they? They're like fly larvae, right? You knew that. But they do that whole like eating rotting flesh thing. The flies, they lay their eggs on whatever they want, meaning like rotting flesh or poop. And then when they're born, they start eating whatever they were born on. If that was everyone's instinct, that'd be pretty gross. It's just om nom nom nom, yes please, more mom, thanks. So there's like 120,000 different types of fly species and therefore maggots, but the actual number is probably a lot higher because like they're tiny and stuff and it's hard to find them. There's one type of fly, the green blow fly, or the Phanacea sericata. And what it's used for is this medical treatment called maggot debridement therapy. Luckily, they don't really do it anymore. It was used like in the 15th century. You would come in with this wound or rotting flesh and the doctor would be all like, here you go, here's some maggots, don't be a wuss. And they'd just like throw a bunch of maggots on you. They don't like actually eat the flesh. They have little like bumps all over their bodies and they like secrete this juice stuff that decays your flesh and then they just wiggle around like meow, 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 meow. and then I guess like they clean your wound. But while these maggots do not eat human flesh, there are some that do. Most notably, the bot fly. The bot fly lays its eggs and the mosquitoes come and they bite you and then the eggs go into your skin and then they hatch and you get these nasty bumps all over you and they're called warbles and Thinking about maggots crawling around inside of me, like it makes me physically sick and I wish that that was a joke, but it's like way not, it's way not a joke at all. How did you guys like that? Did, did, you, did you like it? Did you? You have to be honest with me. And if you did, make sure that you subscribe and push the thumbs up button because then I can do more. And if you want, you can follow me on Twitter at Katie Lane and tell me what kind of animals you would like me to talk about next. Jelly, mouse, it's fine, I got it, I know. Octopus, raccoons, mice. Anyone else have any kind of animal? Oh, Christopher, ponies, got it. Okay, so, you know, I love you all, so make sure that you let me know. Bye.